Okay guys, we're just gonna use Felpro Gaskets ARP hardware to install our front time and cover. I've already pulled the old seal out. Now we're just going to get this kind of hand tight, get it close, because we're still going to have to use the alignment tool. I did use just one drop of blue Loctite on each of the fasteners. I'm not sure if it's recommended or not, but I'd rather them not back out on me. Sorry about all the vehicles driving by. I live on a pretty busy street. There's always someone driving by with a loud vehicle. I'll link the gaskets, the ARP hardware, everything down in the description. So that way if you'd like to run either or. I'll even try to find some like GM gaskets, GM performance. If you'd like to run just like factory gaskets. Felpro is a little cheaper. They make good quality stuff. I run their gaskets on my small block. Chevy, never had any issues out of them. I had good reviews on Amazon where I purchased them. And you can't go wrong with ARP hardware. Plus the 12 point stainless looks a lot better than the factory six hex or the factory hex. And mine were all Dirty, dingy, grimy. I didn't want to spend the time cleaning them up. Yeah, ARP is kind of expensive, but it's worth it. And they're reusable. They're not a one and done. Head bolts are reusable on LSs, unlike the Torque to Yield GM, which I've, I mean, people do reuse those. Like I said, I Loctite at all of my ARP hardware. And we will torque it down once we get it, the alignment correct. I just bought an alignment tool from Sac City Corvette. Basically, once your seal is, the front seal is out, your alignment tool will just go over the crank snout. Just like that. And it self centers your cover for you. It aligns your cover. So that way, whenever you torque it down, you shouldn't have any leaks. Torque specs are 18 pound feet. Like we'll just torque them all in a crisscross pattern.
Then you just go back, make sure all are torqued to 18 pound feet. Except for this one that I missed. Now that they're all torqued, you can remove your alignment tool, which is also your seal installer. So you will get your seal lined up. Grab a dead blow real quick. So like I said, you'll get your seal lined up, get it partially in the cover, and you're just gonna Your seal's installed. All that'll be left is to run your harmonic balancer back on. I'm gonna be running an ARP crank stud or crank bolt as well. It's not torque with uh, degrees, it's just straight 240 foot pounds. And that's all it takes to install the front cover. If you like the video, like, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you on the next one.